this is Rachel for Good Behavior Beginnings, and I wanted to make a quick video to talk about the upcoming content for this channel. We are shifting our focus to be the use of behavior analysis within homeschool. We are going to be homeschooling this year, and that is a new experience for us, and I imagine probably a new experience for many other families. So I just wanted to talk a little bit about what we'll be doing in the future and where we are and what we're doing right now. So why are we homeschooling? The first reason is that the pandemic made us homeschool in the spring. Uh, we didn't receive a ton of communication from the school district and so I was pulling out worksheets and finding books and making it up as I went along. This fall, our options were homeschool, online school, which doesn't work great for my child who likes to move around a lot and wouldn't probably do the best with sitting at a computer for long periods of time. Or the school district was proposing a hybrid model where the kids would go to school two days a week and then do online school the rest of the week. Well, our numbers went back up in the summer, so now it's all online anyway. And we really didn't feel like an option where it might shift from month to month made a lot of sense for our family and, and our kid. So we opted to go with the homeschool. So regardless of what the school district does this year, we are homeschooling for this year. We have the privilege, I guess, right now that um, we can work from home and, and I have a flexible schedule. So I am able to spend time a few hours a day on a focused kind of school, homeschool variation, and then clock in for work and work those hours later in the day. My husband works for tens so he has a few days off and so he's going to be doing the homeschool on a couple of those days and i'll be doing homeschool on a couple of days my background is in behavior analysis i'm a board certified behavior analyst and the most uh, most of my experience has been working with children with autism their families and caregivers and other professionals in the field of behavior analysis. However, the root focus of all of those experiences has been around differentiated learning and individualizing uh, the approach so that a learner can gain the skills that they need, but they're learning in a way that works for them. With that in mind, I feel pretty confident in being able to educate my own child at home and hopefully being able to share some strategies that other people may also find useful. So that really is the goal of these videos. I like to share ideas. I like to share our journey. I believe that there are probably many other people who are undertaking either homeschool or online school or some variation this year and it's a going to be a learning curve for all of us so i thought that this would be a way to share those struggles and to feel a little bit less alone that many of us are going through this and that we're all going to figure it out together and our kids will be fine in the end. So I hope that you will check back for more videos. I hope that you will find this information helpful. And I'd love to hear from you if you are facing similar homeschool or online school uh, future this year. And uh, if there are any particular ideas or questions or things that you have that you'd like me to address. So thanks again for watching and hopefully you'll uh, check back and 
enjoy some of our future videos. Thanks.